think I have frosting on my hair. Hey guys, so I'm back with a video. And today I want to show you guys a few of the new products that I have received in the mail. Um, some of these products I have not opened up yet um, or kind of like peeked into them, but I haven't really, you know, delved into them. So I wanted to do that with you guys on camera because it's always exciting when you have like, you know, people to share it with. So the first box I want to open is this Benefit Ipsy box brow products but and also a surprise here is this hula bronzer so hula bronzer is actually was one of my very first bronzers that i ever owned and i remember feeling so so like legit when i had it but it's a cool tone bronzer most of you i'm sure know it and then it comes with a bunch of brow products now i really like um, brow products from Benefit. I think they work really well and they give, give you a really natural look too. So we have the Goof Proof Brow Pencil, Precision or Precisely My Brow Pencil. Um, I have a Gimme Brow here which is has microfibers in it. What else is in here? <gasps> Ooh, oh my god, I did not see that. We'll get to that right now. Um, I also have a 24 hour brow setter. I really do actually like this brow setter. It is one of my favorite brow setters to use. I have pretty, whoa, I have pretty long eyebrow hair. So I like to put a gel on top of it to really keep them in their place. Cause if not, they kind of just go haywire sometimes or they get really sad and start to droop just not a good look not only do i have hula bronzer but i also now have a cookie oh my gosh wow okay look at that beauty you are the prettiest little thing let's swatch it on the finger oh my gosh that's pretty you can see it on the hand it has like a peachy undertone to it oh my god what a surprise all oh, that just made my night i'm really excited about that <laughs> professional um foundation primer it is one of the best pore refining primers that you can find out there i have roller lash since i've never tried out this mascara before I definitely want to try it out for the first time and create a little a little video demo on my Instagram story. And then I also have the Bad Gal Bang uh, Eyelash Mascara. <laughs> Whoa, I totally blinked out on the name there. Whoa. That's fierce. Very fierce. That kind of looks a little scary, I'm not going to lie. This is by It Cosmetics, and then it's their new limited edition It's Your Confidence Superpowers pack here. I'm just going to quickly go through them because there's just so many here that I don't want to spend too much time on each one. So my favorite, one of my favorite mascaras is Superhero by It Cosmetics. It just gives you a really nice, full, thick look to your lashes. Um, and I really, really like that in a mascara. So I'm really excited that I have a new tube because I ran out of mine like over a year ago. Confidence in a gel. This is an oil-free um, gel uh, hydrator. Um, yeah, hydrator moisturizer. And it's for all skin types. Here is the Confidence in a Cream. It's going to help brighten, repair, and transform the under eye area. Confidence in a Neck Cream, which you obviously apply to your neck. I have like frosting in my hair. This is not okay. Confidence in a Cream. This is a moisturizer. Um, it's an anti-aging moisturizer. Cleanser. And this is gentle and for all skin types last but not least is confidence in a cream rosy tone and this is for aging skin this is what it looks like on the inside it looks like pudding and 
things like this make you just want to, you know, take a taste. But it's not food. It just looks like food, but it's not food. Okay. The next few things are from Pixie. And I have some skincare here. I have the Rose Cream, um, which is a moisturizer. And I actually do really like their skincare products. I have the Glow Mist here, which I've never tried this, so I'm excited to give it a go. It's an all over face mist, so it's supposed to help give you that nice, glowy, healthy skin. Um, that everybody really wants. Um, so I think that you can just apply this whether you have makeup on or you don't have makeup on. Next is their Endless Silky Eye Pin. And it looks like a Kajal liner. Let's see how smooth. Oh, it's really smooth. Cool. Okay. Matte Last Liquid Lipstick. And this is in the color Berry Beauty. And this is the color that is in the box. And let's go ahead and give this a swatch. Whoa, it's very beautiful. There's that. I actually have the collection of these and I've swatched them on another video. So I'll link that, that video down below if you wanna watch it. But these are very pigmented. It smells very fruity and um, they last a very good while on your lips. Um, lip Lift Max, which is a glossy lip plumper. And it's just a clear colored lip plumper. That smells like vodka. I know what vodka smells like, and that smells like vodka, honey. Okay. So see, it's just clear. What? That's so interesting. <laughs> and this is very exciting. This is their um, Eye Reflection Shadow Palette. And this is in... It doesn't have a name. Or does it? Yes, it does. Reflex Light is the name of this eyeshadow palette so let's open this up these are the colors of the palette and we'll swatch a few won't swatch all of them because wow that's pretty and let's do this one. Oh wow and why don't we do this one so these are three of the colors very silky eyeshadows, at least to the touch, and they're very pigmented as well. They look like they would be really easy to blend on the eyes. Okay, I have a bag here from Rimmel, and I'm not going to go through every single thing in here because it's stuffed with a bunch of products. So I'll just pull out some of the bigger items. So, they're obviously super eclectic colors in this palette. And, whoa, the little applicator fell out. Um, I've never ever tried these palettes out before, but I'm interested as to like how they swatch. There's one color. Do another one. To this blue one so these are colors that i will not use on myself let's be real here right they kind of look kind of chalky which to me i've had chalky colors before they just have a bunch of fallout and they tend to not really wear very well so I don't know about that. This next palette looks um, a little bit more neutral. This one is the Reloaded Edition. And these are the colors there. These are more colors that I would wear. So, let's watch those. Let's try them on the back of the hand. Okay, these 
swatch a lot better. And this is the Thunderstorm Edition palette. Well, why would I swatch that one? That like doesn't. It's like so so beige. Okay, these are these colors. And we'll put these here. Oh, pretty. So those are those colors. I really like this um, white gold color. They sent me they sent me their gel eyeliner, which I have not tried. So I'm excited to try this because I like to do liner on the top. Y'all know that. We have a few liquid lip colors here, and these are <sighs> okay. I, yeah. Totally totally not me totally out of my comfort zone this one is called rosetto oh no it's called pitch black sorry okay so it's a black alrighty then whoa honey okay that's intense I could see this for like I don't know like a picture like a artistic picture that you want to take with makeup this one is called shadow and this is like a dark dark gray color here. There's that one. I mean, some people are into lip colors like this. I mean, not knocking it and just saying like, so not me. Blue iris. This looks like a purple. <laughs> okay, there you go. Okay, we have some more Magnifa Eyes palette collection here. Okay, we have um, the Jewel Rocks edition. I think these are more like jewel tone colored eyeshadows. So, why don't we go with this one, this one, and this one. very pigmented they swatch very nicely wow edition these are the colors very cool tone colors let me grab this one and this one and these are the three colors I grabbed can't really see it, huh? It's pretty light. These are very iridescent colors. Um, Rimmel's Maxi Blush in the color Third Base. Seems to be like a coral color and it has a gold sheen to it. Here. I'm really picking it up here. Alright, there it is. Lastly, some lip products, and I'm all about lip products here. Um, why don't we swatch this one? This is the Stay Glossy um, in the color. Doesn't down to gloss number 125. So, this looks like a peachy color with some shimmer in it. Oh yeah, definitely gold shimmer. There's that color. I would wear this for sure. And we have a red lip combo here. This is a lip pencil in the color Red Dynamite. And oh no, I don't like pencils like this. Yeah, these feel like um, an actual colored pencil rubbing on your lips, which is not very pleasant. Um, this is the color Dat Red. Mm. 
very creamy. I'd be a little scared of this like kind of running all over the place, but it's a very pretty color. And I have two palettes from Urban Decay. Um, this is the Urban Decay on the Run collection. This is in Highway Queen. And I'm going to take it out the box here. This is the packaging. And here are the colors. How gorgeous. So warm. Mm, so beautiful. The next one is called G Train. And take this one out. There's that one. Ooh, pretty. Very earth tone colors in this collection. So for now, that is basically all of the things that I want to show in this video. I do have other things that have gotten sent, but I don't want this video to be like 30 minutes long. It's kind of ridiculous, but I hope you guys enjoyed watching all those things. That's it. Um, I hope you guys have a great rest of your day or evening or that you sleep well if you're watching this right before bed. Um, but uh, God bless you, and I'll see you guys very soon. Bye.